the dissection of back muscles. For that, we have to give incision, one vertical incision and nearby three horizontal incision. One vertical incision is from the external occipital protuberance up to the natal cleft. It may be extended up to the spinous process of T12. And how we can uh, judge that it is uh, transverse spinous process of T12? Because the angle of his, uh, inferior angle of his scapula is palpable. And at that level, there is T7 spinous process. And from that counting, we can progress up to the T12. It can be extended up to T12. And for better vision, we should go up to the natal cleft. This is in between the two better, there is a natal cleft. Now, first nearby horizontal is from the superior nuchal line, going laterally. Second, from the acromion process, strict horizontally up to the middle line. Okay? And third one is from the T12 spinous process and going laterally by making a convexity downward. Third, or if we are approaching up to the natal cleft, it should go laterally by forming a convexity upward. This is a iliac crest. This vertebra is a convexity downward. Now, we are seeing what we are seeing is the superficial muscles of the back. They are two that is, the, this is trapezius, and below is the latissimus dorsi. Trapezius, as it is of trapezium shape, like this. So, it is trapezius. It takes its origin from the letter T, T for trapezius and T. That from the external occipital protuberance, superior nuchal line, medial one third. This is ligamentum nuchae, C7 spinous process, spinous process of up to T12. This is the site of origin. Now going insertion is from, it has got descending fiber, horizontal fiber and ascending fiber. Now it is going to the posterior border of the clavicle, lateral one third. Then horizontal fiber is going to the medial border of the chromium process. And ascending fiber is going to the, to the upper, upper lip of the crest of the spine of the scapula. Okay, so this is trapezius and it is supplied by the spinal accessory nerve and here here it runs this is our spinal accessory nerve okay on the back of this muscle when we cut parallel to the vertebral column this what we are seeing this is our spinal accessory nerve okay and the action of trapezius muscle is the shrugging of shoulder Okay? Yes. And its proprioceptive is from the C3 and C4. Now coming to the second superficial muscle that is latissimus dorsi. It takes its origin from the later L. This is one L and this is another L. So it takes its origin from the T6 to T12 spinous process, then lumbar vertebra spinous process, then thoracolumbar fascia, outer lip of the iliac crest, posterior aspect. From here, as well as the lower three to four rib, as well as inferior angle of scapula. From this, vast origin, it is going to a small place by after twisting and forming the posterior uh, axillary fold. Posterior axillary fold and going to the floor of the bicepital groove. That lady between two major. Okay, now latissimus dorsi, it is supplied by the nub to latissimus dorsi, which is the branch of the posterior cord of the brachial plexus. And its action is external rot uh, extension, uh, uh, medial rotation, uh, and adduction. Okay, now if we reflect this trapezius muscle upward, what we are seeing, here is the medial border of the scapula. This is the root of the spine of the scapula. And here is the superior angle. And this is, this is from superior angle.
angle okay this is whole of this is crest of spine okay and this is root of spine and here is the superior angle from superior angle up to the root of spine this muscle this muscle which is going to the spinous process of c1 to c4 this one is levator scapular muscle okay now here from here to here is this one is the rhomboidus minor only this one इससे अलग इसको ना थोड़ा सा अलग करते हैं तो अच्छा ठीक है यहाँ पे अलग हो रहा है दोनों ठीक है यहाँ से लेके यहाँ तक ये है रंबोइडा स्पाइनर सिर्फ रूट ऑफ स्पाइनर पे से ना यहाँ से ऑरिजिन लिया है एंड गोइंग टू द यहाँ पे C7 है एकदम बगल में है यहाँ पे C7 C7 एंड T1 वहाँ के स्पाइनस प्रोसेस पे चला गया अब इतना बड़ा जो है ये रंबोइडस मेजर रंबोइड सिर्फ का है और बड़ा है रंबोइडस मेजर हो गया होल ऑफ द मीडियल बॉर्डर From the root of spine up to the inferior angle. So we have bodus measure ho gaya. So yes, ye tha C7 se T1, and ye T2 to T5. Waha ke spinous process pe ja ke insert ho gaya. Sab ko hi dorsal scapular nerve. Isko agar hamlo karenge na, yahan se kaatenge to iske piche yahan pe dorsal scapular nerve. Sab ka piche piche se aa raha hai. Yahan se isko kaatenge to yahan pe jaise spinal accessory nerve dekhe, waise yahan pe dorsal scapular nerve iske piche se aa raha hai. ठीक है अब देखते हैं हम लोग ट्रायंगल ऑफ ऑस्कल्टेशन तो ट्रायंगल ऑफ ऑस्कल्टेशन दिस इज आवर लैटिसमस डोसाई सुपीरियर बॉर्डर ऑफ द लैटिसमस डोसाई इज द मीडियल बॉर्डर ऑफ द स्कैपुला एंड दिस इज द लैटरल बॉर्डर ऑफ द ट्रिपीरियर दिस रीजन दिस रीजन इज नोन एज ट्रायंगल ऑफ ऑस्कल्टेशन फ्लोर ऑफ व्हिच इज फॉर्म बाय द रोमबोइडस मेजर मसल एंड द सेवन एंड एट रिप यहाँ से ऐसे जा रहा है ठीक है सिक्स सेवन एट रिप हाँ एंड रोमबोइडस मेजर तो इसका क्या काम हो गया जैसे ट्रायंगल ऑफ ऑस्कल्टेशन टी ओ ए तो वही उसका काम भी हो गया तो टी से हो गया थोड़ा सा प्रोसीजर क्योंकि यहाँ पे कम मसल है कम मसल को काटना पड़ रहा है तो थोड़ा सा प्रोसीजर का ये प्रेफर्ड चॉइस है कोई भी यहाँ से सर्जरी थोड़ा सा सर्जरी करना पड़े तो यहाँ से अप्रोच किया जाता है ओ से हो गया ओसो फेजियल ट्यूमर ओसो फेजियल ट्यूमर हो जाएगा तो स्प्लासिंग वहाँ पे आके लिक्विड आगे नहीं जा पा रहा है सचो ट्यूमर से ब्लॉक हो गया है सफेगस तो वहाँ से बहुत अच्छे से मैंने यहाँ पे स्टेटोस को प्रकिंगे तो स्प्लासिंग साउंड लगे यहाँ कि वहाँ से आगे बढ़ ही नहीं पा रहा है ठीक है तो ऐसे फेजियल ट्यूमर है और टीओए और एडवेंटिसियस साउंड अगर हो जाता है हार्ट का ल